Good afternoon, friends. I want to say right away that this video message is a request for financial assistance, which is now the most effective for horse owners and horses in Ukraine. This is my second video message since the beginning of the war in Ukraine. I want to say that over the past two weeks, the situation with the safety and maintenance of horse and horse owners has worsened, and I think that it will be even worse and harder. The situation is especially difficult near Kyiv and Kharkov. Bombs hit several stables near Kyiv. Many horses have died as a result of this. One horse base was flooded as a result of dam explosion. Unfortunately, the centralized assistance which the Ukrainian Equestrian Federation is talking about is not effective. And it is a profanity and cover for the scale of the leadership of the Equestrian Federation of Ukraine. As always, those who have everything get even more, and poor horse owners do not get anything, or they get what is not needed and not effective. The only effective way is when you know who are personally helping, communicate with this person directly, and then the result is effective. Now, equestrian clubs, which are in a danger zone and do not have the opportunity to earn money as a result of war, need finance to maintain normal condition for keeping and supporting horses, finance to buy sad dust, hay, oats locally, finance to pay staff, finance to buy diesel fuel for generators, call veterinaries and other needs. The difficult situation that has developed forced me to apply with this video message and ask you for money. Any financial help would be helpful. 100,000 people who gave a dollar each can collect together the amount to buy a car to transport horse, for example, and so on. Once again, I want to repeat that the most effective help is only targeted and I am ready to provide you with reports and information on what is needed for the equestrians of the Kyiv region and partially other regions in Ukraine. Thank you very much.